Hey, everyone! Welcome to my channel where I share my thoughts on the latest TV shows, movies, and pop culture trends. Today, I want to talk about, and just like that, the sequel series to The Legendary Sex and the City, and why I think it is a huge disappointment and a betrayal of Carrie Bradshaw's character. And just like that is supposed to follow the lives of Carrie and her friends, Miranda and Charlotte, as they navigate their 50s in New York City. But instead of being a fun and empowering show that celebrates their friendship, their careers and their love lives, the show seems to be determined to destroy everything that made Carrie who she is. First of all, they killed off her husband, Mr. Big, in the first episode, after he had a heart attack while riding a Peloton bike. This was a shocking and heartbreaking twist that made no sense for the story or the characters. Carrie and Big had finally found their happy ending after years of struggles and challenges. They had been married for several years and were still madly in love. They had overcome their differences and their problems and had built a solid and stable relationship. But the show decided to take that away from Carrie in a cruel and unnecessary way. Secondly, they made Carrie quit her job as a writer and podcaster because she felt out of touch with the modern world and the younger generation. Carrie had always been passionate about writing and sharing her insights on relationships and sex. She had a successful column, several books, and a loyal fan base. She had also started a podcast with her new friend Shay, a non-binary comedian. But the show made her feel insecure and irrelevant in the age of social media and influencers. They made her quit her podcast after she had a disagreement with Shay over their views on sex. They made her doubt her abilities and her identity as a writer. And thirdly, they introduced a new love interest for her, Che Diaz, Shay's co-host and Miranda's crush. Che is rude, arrogant, and disrespectful to Carrie. They mock her for being old-fashioned and clueless. They flirt with Miranda behind her husband's back. And they have no chemistry with Carrie whatsoever. But the show wants us to believe that Carrie is falling for Che because they are supposedly funny and charming and edgy. They even had Carrie kiss Che in the latest episode, after Che showed up at her apartment uninvited and unannounced. This was a terrible decision that made no sense for Carrie's character or the story. Carrie deserves better than this. She deserves to be happy and fulfilled in her personal and professional life. She deserves to be respected and appreciated by her partner. She deserves to be true to herself and her values. She deserves to have a story that honors her legacy as one of the most iconic characters in TV history. But and just like that does not want that for her. The show ruins Carrie's character arc and happiness. The show is a disappointment and a disaster. And that's why I hate it. I am not going to watch any more episodes of And Just Like That. I am going to pretend that it never happened. I am going to remember Carrie as she was in Sex and the City, smart, stylish, witty, romantic, adventurous, and fabulous. What do you think of And Just Like That? Do you agree with me or do you have a different opinion? Let me know in the comments below. And don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel for more content like this. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.